What's up guys? I'm back again. Playing more WoW. We're at Stranglethorn. And actually as I am recording this video. <laughs> this guy is just fucking dancing with me. But as I'm recording this video. I pretty much did all the boring quests off camera because man, some of those quests were so boring, dude. There's this one quest in Stranglethorn where you have to like find some some uh fucking I don't know, I'm just gonna fucking I don't know what emote to do, I just did the fart emote. I don't fucking know, but anyways. I appreciated him dancing with me. That was pretty nice. That was like some that was some good shit right there. But um, yeah, I did all the boring quests, and there's literally a quest that I was doing, and I actually had a video. I was recording myself doing it, but man, dude, it I, I kid you not, it literally took like 40 minutes to find this one item. And and for the people who know about this quest, you guys know it's pretty hard to find this item. But basically, it's a quest where you have to get like this. You have to get like this Sinu or like a some like something from a gorilla, something from the elder Mistvale gorilla for the horde side. And oh my gosh, it takes so long to farm. So that kind of just like freaking that was kind of pissing me off while I was recording. So I was like, you know what? Fuck this bullshit. I'm not gonna upload this video or this footage. Ew. It's some trash, anyways. But yeah, we're here in Booty Bay. I did most of the boring quests. Um, the Skull Splitter Tusk, these quests that I have tracked on the right side, so I completed them, I just gotta turn them in, and guys, we are level 39 too, and look at the experience bar, we are so close, so close, to level 40, and you know what that means, you know what that means guys, and if you don't know what that means, basically, once shamans hit level 40, um, they can learn how to use or learn how to equip male armor, which is just like You get like a huge power spike and huge like uh, Just like overall buff to your stats and like armor and shit So that's gonna be uh, pretty big. I feel like well 100% once we turn in these quests. We're gonna level up um, But yeah, I saved these shoulder pads. I got I just found them from something. I think it was a chest or it was either a chest or a drop. I, I can't really remember, but I've been saving these shoulder pads. And um they look pretty good, but my helmet looks kinda whack. They don't look good with my helmet. Maybe I'll just uh turn the show helm off once I learn how to um wear mail. But guys, look at this, dude. We had I had 20 gold last night. And then I, after, next thing I know. I'm freaking selling things in the auction house, and then I have zero gold. I'm like, wait, what? What happened? So, hopefully this male right here is gonna save my save my booty cheeks and my bank. Um, because I am broke. We are down bad, folks. But alright, let's turn in this quest. The Skull Splitter Tusk. And this quest also, I did off camera, because it was, it, it was so boring. Um, I just was farming trolls. There's really nothing eventful going on. But yeah, let's uh, turn in this quest. Ooh, and we get some monies. That's what I like to see. Ah, good work, good work. Ugh. Though you could have done a better job cleaning off the... Well, no matter, no matter. My thanks to you, Hello B. Our operation will no doubt see increased output and productivity thanks to your help. Good, good. Now, on to other matters. Alright, let's complete the quest. Man, this motherfucker said I could do a better job. It's... Man, you go out there and do it then, motherfucker. Right back! Oh, okay, that's the end of the quest line. Maybe he gives another quest at a yeah. higher level, I don't know. Um, okay, so we turn in that quest. We have to turn in one more quest. Is this at Grom? Oh, it's at Gromgall. Oof. Uh, okay, so in this video, what I'm thinking is we can... Finish this speaking with Nezilok quest. Because that's going to be pretty easy now that we're a little bit higher level. Oh, we didn't level up. Wow, it's I didn't even realize that. Um, oh, I've seen that guy before. Uh, what quest can we do? We can do the Blood Cell Buccaneers quest, because that's just like a discover quest. You just have to discover some place, and then um, it'll um, finish the quest. Uh, once we hit 40, we could definitely try. T uh, we could definitely do uh, Tethys, because he's level 43, so he's going to be a lot easier to kill. We could do the Akiris quest here, uh, too. 
Hopefully they drop pretty. Um, hopefully they drop fast, or else, man, I'm gonna have to cut that footage. Okay. All right. You know what? Let's um. We need to go to Gromgol, right? Yeah, Gromgol is probably the best. Okay. Let's check the bank. Hopefully, uh, we sold some things in the auction house. <clears throat> and I kind of fucked up um, with my auctions because I canceled a bunch of them. So that's why I lost a bunch of gold. I didn't realize the deposits for some of them were so much. So I shouldn't have canceled them, but... Oof. Okay, we got some monies. We got some monies. Alright, it's only been a day since we put it up. And we put the auction up for... Uh, three days. Or two days, excuse me. Okay, let's now go to... Gromgol. Alright guys, we're at Gromgol. Uh, before we turn in this quest to that dude, let's um... Let's finish the Speaking with Nesliot quest. So for this quest, we just have to get the bones. Um, the bones of these guys. Balima and Zulmanwe, or the ruins, and uh, the bones and the ruins from these motherfuckers. Right. And basically, alright, so yeah, we gotta go to uh, each of these ruins and collect the trophies. And I already got one of them, so we just need two more. So it's gonna be really, it's gonna be pretty easy. We might have to fight a couple of trolls here and there, but not gonna be too hard. And then Tethys actually is at the bottom of Booty Bay. Where I was fighting the raptors earlier. Or like right over here. Oh no, it's actually, Tethys is actually at Gromgal. Maybe we could fight Tethys uh, too. Before we turn in the quest. Yeah, you know what, let's just fight Tethys. Because I feel like maybe if we get to kill some trolls, we might level to 40. Okay, guys, we are here at the Troll Ruins. One of the bones is in the center of this little uh, ruin thingy-mabob, the Baliyama Ruins. Uh, we can just uh, brute force our way in. Um, these guys aren't too bad. I was farming these guys uh, last night off cam. And they're not too bad, not too bad, guys. We could handle them pretty easily. Nice, nice. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, what's the safest way to do it? I feel like we have to just clear everything out. So let's just fucking clear everything out. Alright, hopefully we can get this guy to cast on us. Nice. Oh, okay, hold up, hold up. Okay, he's a little bit, uh... It's a little bit too close. I want to pull him out just a little bit. This is perfect. Oh, whoops. We. Oh, okay. Nice. We we killed him anyways. I didn't mean. I didn't know he was gonna cast healing wave. But um. Yeah. Nice. Smooth. Very smooth. But um. Yeah. There's some big wow news. Uh, Microsoft. I talked about it a little at the end of my last video, but Microsoft bought uh Blizzard Activision. <clears throat> so. Um, I guess that's pretty good. Um, I'm not really invested in the... Like I said before, I'm not really invested in the drama. And I, or, like, really, I don't know too much about, you know, the drama. But apparently all the Blizzard fans are pretty happy about this, so... I guess that's good, you know? As long as the, the fans are happy, you know? I feel like that's all that matters. Okay, this guy's hitting me through walls now. Oh, nice, we got a Wind Fury. Oh, and a Page, too. Oh, man, I think it's a Page we already have, though. Alright, so how do we cleanly take these guys out? We might have to do a little 2v1 action. Um, this Mystic might be annoying to deal with. Might be pretty annoying. Alright, let's uh, heal up. We could drink this rum, too. Maybe get some more Stam. Alright, let's do it. Let's get some Stam. Alright, let's see if we could just single pull him. I maybe doubt it. 
Oh, okay, we were able to just see what in. Nice, and we're a little drunk right now. Our camera's all like shaky and stuff. But nice, this guy's going down pretty, fi uh, pretty quick. All right, let's go ahead and take out Mr. Mystic. Just walk up to him, let him cast. Kite him towards us a little. Oh, okay, I don't want that. Okay, let's do that again. I want to kite him back a little towards my totems. Okay, nice. All right, we could save the shock for this guy. That spell is ready yet. Alright, and the bones are right here, so this is the Baliyama, uh bones. And we already got the Ziataja. Man, I don't even know what the fuck. Z Ziataja? Ziataja. We already got the Ziataja bones. Oh, we got another page too. Cool stuff. Uh, so now we just get the, I gotta get the Zulmamwe uh, trophy. And uh, we could probably head back. Oh, and we're almost level 40, guys. Oh my gosh, actually, we're so close to level 40. I think we're just, I think we're a mob or two, or yeah, a mob or two away. Very nice. This is gonna be huge, guys. Hopefully, I have enough gold to buy the uh, plate, or excuse me, the mail training. Because, man, I have only three gold right now. I'm down bad skis. Uh, okay, so we gotta go to Zomamwe, which is down here. And we gotta get the last trophy. And if I remember correctly, it's not really in the ruins. Oh, what's going on here? You guys are just like, are they doing like a rocky moment? Are they like training, doing like some rocky shit? Whoa, 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 he's coming back. What's going on? What the fuck? What are these guys doing? This is like the training arc? Oh, wow, what the heck just happened? That was so weird. Alright, but uh, yeah, if I remember correctly, should be somewhere around here. It's not like really in the ruins. I think it's kind of outside of it. Like, is it? I think it's here, maybe? Possibly? Uh, hold up. Okay, I gotta look for bones on the ground. Bones, bones. Oh! There it is. Zomamwe trophy. Oh god, they got the freaking Avengers here. I gotta back up. Gotta let these guys just peacefully move along while I the while I'm unnoticed. I just gotta let I just gotta I just gotta let these guys peacefully make their way. And we should be good. Gotta watch out for this gorilla too. Uh, oh, and the beastmaster. Oh, now he's in the way now. This is why I love. This is why Hunter is my second favorite class to play because of the freaking pets. And I love how exotic some of the animals are in this game. It's pretty dope. It's pretty freaking dope if you ask me. Alright, we might be able to avoid this Beastmaster. I I'm kind of taking it slow right now because I, I don't want to... I don't want to fight that Beastmaster. And I don't want to take any fights that I don't need to. Hopefully I don't pull aggro on these boys. These guys are just vibing out, man. Yeah, I don't want to fuck with these guys. These guys are just chilling. Alright. Oh, oh, and there's a chest here. Hello. We could, uh... Here, let, let's deal with this guy first. Let's just clear the whole area out now. So the Beastmaster's gone, and the freaking, um... Thanos fucking squad is gone. So we could probably safely go ahead and grab these, uh... Oh, and we leveled up. Nice. So we're level 40, guys. This is huge. We could wear mail now. This is gonna be freaking awesome, guys. We are gonna have a big power spike. All right, let's just uh, deal with these guys. I want to get that uh, chest. Might uh, might be something good in there, you know? Maybe, maybe. Smack him up! Come on! Oh, and we got a win free. Oh, and another page. All right, let's go fight this mystic now. Let's interrupt this guy. Pop a mana spring. I'm gonna pull him back a little bit. Try to pull him back as much as I can. Nice. 
Oh, no, no, no. Hit him one more time. Nice. Perfect. Okay. Now we can get the chest. Okay, let's put our talent point in. Oh my gosh, guys. Here it is. Wait, hold on. Also, a huge moment for us. Um, delicious cave mold. I'll drop you. I'm going to take this book because it's going to sell for something. But look at this, guys. This is it, boys. We finally got it. The dual wield. We have an option to go dual wield or storm strike. I'm just going to go dual wield. Fuck the storm strike. It's probably better to just get the storm strike because it's a new ability. But you know what? I don't give a fuck. We're taking the dual wield. Woo! We did it! Alright, so now we can equip uh, one hand and off hand weapons. Uh, wait, what? Allows one hand and off hand weapons to be equipped in the off hand. Okay, yeah, we could do that. Let's get it, boys. Let's freaking get it, boys. Alright, and I also think I messed up a little bit um, in the auction house because I was putting the items. I was selling my items in the Booty Bay auction house, and I think I'm supposed to sell it at the regular Ogre Mar auction house. Uh, I don't think that I don't think the Booty Bay auction house reaches the main city auction houses actually. So, man, that's a big uh, rookie mistake from my part for real. I'm a freaking scrub. I'm in the scrub zone right now. All right, we're done though. Um, let's complete these quests, and then let's go kill Tethys. Tethys will be nice, and we'll get a new uh, chest piece too. That's um. It's gonna definitely be stronger than the one that we have on right now. So we lose a little agility, but we get strength and a bunch of stamina. So it's gonna be very nice. We're gonna be a lot more tankier. All right, and then what should we do? Maybe we'll do the Akira's quest after that, or maybe we'll just stop by Orgrimmar real quick to uh, learn mail. Hopefully we have enough gold to learn it. I think I feel like we'll only have enough gold to learn one thing, maybe. Let's see though. I'm gonna turn in these quests. Uh, we could do Tethys really quickly because Tethys is literally like right here, and we're already at Ground Gall, so we're kind of close. Uh, let's do Tethys and then let's learn our male abilities ability, and then we could equip these shoulder pads. It's gonna be freaking sick, guys. Strength and honor. All right, guys. Let's do this. Uh, let's talk to Ken Wele first. Relax. So this is for uh, the split bone necklace quest. The skull splitters will curse the day they brought us to war. Is your task complete? It is. Your strength is great to have gained these necklaces. Hello B. The skull splitters fall to you like young saplings stomped to earth by a basilisk. Your deeds are a boon to us. Thanks man. Alright, we'll take these too because oh, and we could wear these as well. Uh, we probably don't want to sell these. Okay, okay. So let's keep these because these are male too. Oh, this is gonna be nice. Let's see what these look like. Oh, nice. Got these little like chain link uh, boots. Uh, let's see what with the shoulders. All right, all right. I'm looking kind of ugly, but oh, the shoulders match the axe though. I'm gonna uh, do hide helm because the helm is kind of ruining the fit. I mean, my fit is kind of trash, to be honest, but I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to be optimistic, but... So, let's see if I look better. Hopefully, we'll look better without the uh, helm showing. Alright, so we did that. Let's go ahead and, uh, speaking with Nesliok. Let's do this. We got to give this dude the trophies. I await the skulls. Alright, here you go. Here you go, you creep. Freaking... Don't know why you need these. Yes, these will serve me well. When my spirit is freed, I will enter the nether with three fine servants. Oh, right, yeah, he, he's using these guys as his servants. You are a credit to your orc clan. Oh, wait, whoops. You are a credit to your orc clan, and you have appeased me. Oh, that's it? Nothing crazy? Alright. Oh, we have another quest. Speaking with Gonzula, right? We already, we said, this, is, this one's a little bit harder. Oh, it's a red quest. Oh my lanta, these are a lot of these are a lot of guys we gotta kill. That'll be fun to watch though. That'll be a fun uh, video to do. I don't think we're gonna do it this video, but I feel like I've um I feel like doing the quests that require just like killing things is a lot better to show than doing quests that require you to like find a collectible from them. Cause gosh gar gosh darn it. 
sometimes you freaking farm for like an hour freaking for these quests with the collectible things. It is a pain. It is a freaking nightmare, man. But okay, guys, let's go kill Tethys real quick, and then we'll head over to uh, Orgamore. All right, we're at the Raptor Nest, which is outside of the Gurubashi Arena, um, and Tethys should be here. I believe he is really deep, though, uh, within this Raptor little Raptor Nest kind of vibe. Last time I saw him, he was here. And he shouldn't be that hard to find either because he's a blue raptor. So we just gotta keep our eyes peeled for a blue raptor. But the last time I was here, uh, I saw him here, I think. Or maybe it was deeper. Let's check deeper. Alright, looking for a blue raptor. Hey guys, have you guys seen a blue raptor? No? Nobody? Alright. I'm gonna keep on looking. Quiet crowd today. I kinda like it though. It's nice and peaceful. Oh, maybe he's over here. Maybe he's... Here? Oh, no, these are where the blood cells are. Okay, so no Tethys. Uh, we do have some blood cells though. Ooh, these guys are kinda... Scary. Alright, let's take another wrap around. See if we can find Tethys. Maybe someone killed him. Oh, we found him, boys. Here he is. There's Tethys. Right, let's give this guy the, uh... Let's give this guy the 1-2 special. Let me clear the way first. Alright. Let's make sure we are have full HP. Full mana. We could drink this uh, rum again to get some more stam. And alright, he's only level 42. This is only two levels above us. This guy should be no problem. No problemo. Uh, let's do this. Start off with the lightning bolt to the dome skis. And then probably hit him with the second one. And let's pull him back a little. Towards our Searing Totem. Just give this guy the works. Give this guy the beat down. Oh, my Lanta. Th that Wind Fury, man. Oh my gosh, he exploded. Let's go, guys. Talon of Tethys. Let's get it. Alright, so now we just have to uh, go back to Nesting Way. And then we could uh, go to Ogremar. Uh, let me get this, let me get this uh, Iron real quick, though. Alright guys, we're back at the Nesting Way camp. Oh, what the heck? Oh. I thought that was a freaking um mob. Great to meet uh, let's you. go let's go ahead and turn in the Raptor Mastery quest. My father's off to more exotic locations in search of bigger prey. Don't worry though, we're still here we're still on the hunt here. How goes the hunt for Tethys? Tracked her all the way back to camp, did you? Yes I did. Master Hello B, the Raptor Slayer. Has a nice ring to it, eh? You will receive Raptor Hunter Tunic. Oh, and he gives another quest. My th father's off to- oh, okay, here, here, here he said that. Hello B, you are a hunter worthy of our company. From the battlefields of Lordaeron to the deepest jungle, I have rarely witnessed such prowess with weaponry as you have demonstrated. You have killed the ferocious Sindal, the elusive Bagthera, and the treacherous Tethys. But the true prize is the head of King Bangalash. Oh shit, that guy is an elite. This is an elite quest, by the way. Oh, it's a suggested player's three. Alright, what is That white tiger is the reason I am here. I've had my sights on him for quite some time now. Kill King Bangalash, and your hunting prowess is proven to be second to none. Alright. Ooh, and we get some. Oh, this is for hunters, though. Um. Oh, look at that. Let me see what these look like. Do these look cool? Man, these look lame as hell. Who the fuck would want any of these fucking items? Mas this is called the Master's Hunter's Bow. This should look lame as hell. Whatever, I might accept the quest anyways. Alright, uh, what is it? This is this guy is the chapter's attention. quest, I think. 18-21-24. What pages do I have? Do I have 21? 25, 10... No, I mean, obviously I don't, because I can't turn to the dang quest. 
Alright, what pages do I have, though? Do we have anything we could turn in? Let's check what chapter 2 is. Chapter 2 is 10, 11, 14, and 16. 10, 14, 16? Oh, but no 11. Alright, now let's check what chapter 1 is. 1, 4, 6, and 8. 6, 4, Okay, so we're missing some. Alright, let's uh let's go to Oh let me equip this bad boy. Let me see what this guy looks like. Oh, let me let me get off my mount real quick. Okay, oh it kind of matches the pants too. Alright, alright, that's pretty nice. Looking like a fucking like Aladdin or some shit. I don't even fucking know, man. Looking kinda lit right now. Alright, let's go to Ogremar, though, and let's learn the male ability. Okay, guys, we're here. We're at the Shaman Trainer, and here it is, guys. Oh my gosh. I am hyped for this. So we can learn male. We do have enough gold for it, fortunately, but we don't have enough gold for everything else, which kind of sucks, and we get a pretty big power spike. Ooh, Wind Fury level 2. Oh, we're so broke, though. Searing Totem and Flame Shock. Oh my god, this is such a big power spike, but man, we can't really buy these yet. Oh, and a Chain Heal. Very nice. Alright, we're just gonna buy the mail, though. It's fine. Just Go level that up. We can worry about those other things later. Alright, guys, here we go. Oh, let me, uh... Let me, uh, look at my character real quick. Alright, let's equip the boots. Oh, let me see what boots we got on now. Okay. I guess... I guess it kind of matches my fit. Oh, this is actually... It's actually not bad. The shoulders and the hat don't really match, but I like the fit. Alright, we're gonna change it up though. Alright, so here we go. Dark Spear Boots. We can finally wear mail. It is not redded out. The letters aren't redded out. Let's go. Boom. Ooh. Alright. Nice, nice. Okay, shoulders. Ooh. Okay. Let me pull, let me pull out the axe. Maybe. Oh my gosh. Alright, there we go. Fashion, baby. The uh, shoulders match the axe. All right, let me uh, let me hide my helmet real quick. Oh, we are looking like a menace, bro. All right, this is much better. All right, let's fucking get it, boys. All right, I'm gonna go back to Stranglethorn, um, but but before I do that. I have to sell a bunch of things on the auction house the, that I'm not going to show you guys, but I got to do that because I need to make some money, man. Holy freaking A. We have two gold, man. We're down bad. All right, guys. We're back at Stranglethorn. Um, let's, I'm going to do a couple of quests and then probably end the video afterwards. Um, but let's start off with the Blood Cell Buccaneers. So all I have to do is just like, uh, kind of just like walk in this area and then it should complete the quest for me. Pretty boy Duncan. And I think we might have to, oh, okay, no, it's right there. Oh, and there's a chest there as well. Hello. All right, so let's uh, clear out these blood sails. Set up my totes first. All right, so, so we did get a little bit stronger, but unfortunately we couldn't, um, we couldn't level up our skills. That would have definitely made us a lot stronger. Okay, do I get the cleave off on him? I do. Nice. Switch targets. Okay, this, this, these guys are kind of strong. We're doing pretty decent on health, though. Mana, we're definitely running low. Oh, nice. Okay, got some cloth. Uh, we can go ahead and mana up, I guess. Probably gonna have to deal with these guys. Just so I can get this chest too, because that's gonna be pretty nice. Maybe there's like an equipment in there. Because gosh dang it, look at our freaking money. We got 32 gosh darn silver. We are down bad, guys. And that's just because um, put, we sold a bunch of stuff on the auction house, so we had to. We gotta put in that deposit, man. Gotta put in that deposit, man. <laughs> so hopefully, you know, all of that is. Uh, all of it will be worth it, you know? Let's go ahead and smack him once more. Frost shock him. He's probably gonna run away. Alright, nice, nice. Oh, we got some silver. We got some silver. 
Uh, let's go ahead and uh, complete this quest. Oh, we get some silver from this. Uh, report your findings to First Mate Kraz. Okay, let's read this. The map shows Booty Bay with a red X drawn precisely at the spot at which you are standing. The scribble text reads, You men are to secure a camp at this uh, location and keep quiet. Wait for the signal from the southern command post before attacking. If anyone approaches you, kill them. Okay, okay, hold on. We gotta deal with this guy. Freaking, this guy is freaking ruining my video, man. What the heck? I'm gonna end your shit, bro. Gotta fuck your shit up, motherfucker. Yeah, that's right. Alright, so we gotta report our findings to First Mate Kaz or whatever his name is. First Mate Kraz. Okay, we got some uh, stuff. We got a heavy war staff, so that's pretty good. Um, pretty good to sell, I feel like. Alright, let's um, let's go ahead and do this uh, Akiris Reed quest. This video might be a little bit longer, so sorry if it's a bit longer. I kind of want to just do more um, in this video. Um, so sorry about that, guys. I know that my last video was kind of short. It was only like 45 minutes or something like that. So, yeah, let me know if you guys, let me know in the comments if you guys like long videos, if you guys like short videos, or if you guys really don't care. Uh, it would really help me out so I can know, you know, maybe to shorten the videos, maybe, or, oh my gosh, this guy's still chasing me. Okay, he's not chasing me. You know, like, maybe shorten the videos. Um, so, yeah, let me know. Uh, like, these guys are level 44. Um, they look pretty freaking tough. Let's try to kill one. And hopefully, we can do so easily. Alright, nice. We got a Wind Fury. Alright, I guess I'll hit you with the Earth Shock. Oh, he resisted. That's not good. Uh-oh, we're out of mana, too. Come on, we need a big crit on this guy's face. I need a big crit, baby. Oh, they run. Uh oh, okay. So I gotta make sure to frost shock them before I kill them. Or when they're low HP. Alright. These guys aren't too bad. We could definitely manage doing these guys. Um, NBD. We also got an Akiris Reed, too, so that's pretty nice. So we just need, we need 10 Akiris Reeds, we need to kill 10 of these guys, and then we need to, um, uh, find some Holy Spring Water, which is at the top of this little, uh, mountain area. There's like, a ruins there, a Naga ruins there, and that's where the Holy Water is. So, now that we know that valuable information, let's, uh, make our way towards the top of the mountain. Oh, this guy's only level 43. Okay, so I think the max level of these guys is 44. So that's that's really good. They probably don't go higher than 44. All right, definitely doable. Uh oh, he resisted my uh, flame shock. I'm gonna hit him with another one. All right, we need some big crits. Okay, that was a wind fury. And he chunked away a lot of his health. Oh, and we got another wind fury. Very nice. We can open up these clams too. Zesty clam meat. We could use this for cooking. We have a recipe for zesty clam meat, right? Oh no, giant clam meat. Not zesty. I'm sorry for the ze all the zesty boys out there. You're not wanted this time. All right, let's go ahead and give this guy the beat down. All right. Reapply my light shield. Hit him with the shock. Proceed to beat, give him the beat off. I mean, the beat down, excuse me. Oh no, he's resisting. Uh -oh. These guys are tough, but I could definitely, I could definitely manage 1v1s. Alright, yeah, you see that little ruins right there? That's where the holy spring water is, so that's where we gotta go. So let's make our way towards that direction. Um, oh my gosh, this, this place is heavily guarded. Alright. I'm ready to get down though. Oh man, I might not be able to pull a single one. It might be a double pull. Uh, let's try it though. Fuck it. Okay, we might be able to get him now. He looks like he's a little bit farther away from his buddy. Alright. Nice pull. This, the pull I'm scared of is this one right here though. 
Um, this looks like we might get a, um, a double pull, which is not good. Oh, and this guy's a tanky boy. Uh oh, the parries are real. Come on. You can do it, hello B. You can do it. One more hit. Nice. Oh man, that guy was kind of tough. Oh man. Uh, I feel like I can get a solo pull on this guy. So, um, should be pretty easy to get to the Holy Spring Water. Uh, we need eight more reeds and then we need four more explorers. Uh, hopefully we can find a bunch of reeds fast. So we don't have to farm these guys for a gosh dang hour, man. Alright, let's do this though. Let me summon my totes. Uh, we could definitely get a single pull off on this guy, right? Okay, we got a single pull. That is freaking awesome. Alright, let's do it, boys. I'm hungry. And I want some fish for dinner. Alright, maybe that wasn't threatening enough. I don't know. I tried. I tried. Okay, guys. I tried. I tried to scare him. He's kind of scaring me, though. I don't think it worked. Oh, we got a Wind Fury. Look at that HP. Just went straight down. Uh, we have to... Oh, my Lanta. Please, just die. Just die, please. Just please just go down. Why are you not going down? Why are you not going down, man? You have caused me so much trouble. Now I have to fight this guy. Uh-oh. Okay, we have to pop a big heal. We have to pop a big heal, and then we'll pop a smaller heal. And then we'll Blood Fury. And then we go. Oh, boy. He resisted my Flame Strike. Or, yeah. Uh-oh. Or Flame Shock. Alright, so we have to do this the old-fashioned way. Just good old-fashioned beatdown. We have all of her totems up, though, so that's good. Okay, nice. You didn't resist that one. Okay, Searing Totem's going down in five. This guy is going down soon, too. Okay, nice. We got a Wind Fury. Oh, my Lanta. That was close. That was freaking... That was too close. To Woo! We made it, though. We freaking made it. All right, let's get our mana back. Uh, we can we could uh just you know squeeze on by past these guys. We don't have to really fight them. Oh, well, we could fight them though, cause we need this. We still need to kill the explorers, and we still need to get the reeds. So I might just fight them anyways. And they are level 43. Okay, we gotta go here now. We gotta get the holy spring water, which I see right here. So you guys gotta go right here. Right click the fountain. Go ahead and pick this guy up. What does this say? Uh, blessings from the Holy Spring of Stranglethorn Vale. Uh, okay. I wonder what it does if you consume it. Uh, I don't want to consume it, though, because it's part of the freaking quest. Can I get another one? Let me see if I can get another one. Let me see what happens when you consume this. It just says, blessings from the Holy Spring of Stranglethorn Vale. Oh, we can maybe get two. There's a five minute cooldown on it. Oh, we can get two. Oh, we can only, okay, okay, let's drink it. Okay, it looks like it did nothing. All right, well, that was uh, very uneventful. Let's just grab another one. All right, all right, let's get, let's uh, fight the rest of these, um, these Nagas. The Naga boys. Oh, okay, come on. You can do this, man. All right. Uh, let's resummon Searing. Let's get down to business. Okay. Very nice. Give this guy the proper beatdown he deserves. Yeah, I feel like if we leveled up our abilities, these guys would be a lot easier to kill. But hey, it's the name of the game, man. Sometimes you... Sometimes you don't have that the gold to get your abilities, so, you know, you gotta farm for it. Nice. Alright. Um, Mokthardin enchantment quest completed. We're still a little bit low on the Akiris Reed, so... I'm just gonna go ahead and farm these guys, and then once I get all ten of them, I will meet back up with you guys, okay? 
So let me go and farm these real quick. Oh yeah, guys, and uh, someone actually, in the beginning of this video, actually, while I was recording, someone was looking for a group for Uldaman, um, and I was really considering of going to Uldaman, but... Uh, maybe in the next video, I'll try to get an Uldaman uh, run. That would be pretty good. I want to try to get all the dungeons, as many dungeons as I can, on the channel. So, maybe next video, I'll try to get an Uldaman run for you guys to see. That would be pretty cool. It's always fun seeing, like... The dungeons and like the bosses for the dungeons. Um, so yeah, that'll be a nice little change of pace from questing. So I'll try to find a group in the next video. Oh, nice. Alright guys, we did it. We got all 10 Akiris Reed. And uh, oh my god, a golden pearl too. What in the world? Oh no, I gotta drop something for this guy. Alright, I guess I'll drop these heavy stones. Ooh, that might sell for a pretty penny at the auction house. But, um, yeah, basi I basically just cut off all the boring parts. I was farming a bunch of these Nagas. Uh, finally got 10, though. Um, let's go back to Booty Bay. We could turn in two quests there. And then we have to go back to Gromgall and then turn in the Mactharden enchantment. So that's gonna be some good stuff. Some good stuff. Uh-oh. That's not good, though. Get away, buddy. And we're almost halfway to level 41, so that's gonna be good. I feel like by the time- I feel like once we turn in these quests, we'll be, like, almost level 41. Not quite there, but I feel like we'll be close. So that's gonna be some good stuff, guys. Uh-oh. You know what? We're just gonna freaking leave Lord Jenkins, this motherfucker, and just start running. Oh boy, these guys are hitting kind of hard. Yeah, let's just freaking run straight through. I don't give a fuck. Oh, this fireball's gonna hurt. Oh no, we're stuck. Okay, we're going, I'm going. Booty Bay guards, help me! Yes, kill him! Whoa, he climbed over. Whoa, where's he going? Where's he going? Help me! Where is he? Where are they going? These guys are useless. Oh my god, get away from me. Dude, they're chasing the wrong guy. Oh my god. Wait, why did my reputation- Oh, I thought it said reputation with Booty Bay. It's with Bloodstail. Okay, that makes sense. Alright guys, we're in Booty Bay. Let's go ahead and turn in these bad boys. Oh, what do we have here? We have an oily black mouth. More oily black mouth. Don't really need oily black mouths. I guess that would be good. Ooh, a stone scale eel swarm. Huh. Oh, we got some more dings. We got some more quests that we can do. Alright, but let's turn in this quest first. The first mate kept Kraz. This is the guy for the Bloodstill Bucks. I'm his money, friend! Sure, I remember you, shaman. Back from scouting, I see. Shiver me timbers! So the Bloodstill Buccaneers are planning some sort of attack on Booty Bay. Why? The nerve of those scoundrels. Booty Bay will always be run by the Blackwater Raiders. This is bigger than I thought. Report what you have learned to Fleetmaster Seahorn at once. The old Sea Dog is around town somewhere. Okay, so we gotta report to Fleetmaster Seahorn, and that's the Torin guy. Oh, let me get these quests. This guy's just straight dinging everywhere. Who, is, who the heck is this? Oh, I guess it's above me. Oh wow, these guys are- there's a lot of- there's some people fishing here. Who's this guy? Oh, okay. Alright, um, hold on. Let's check inside here, because I think we can get a quest. Yep. Can I help you? Alright, um, so we have Stoli's debt. We also have a, another quest that we're doing with him. But let's check out Stoli's debt. My old buddy Stoli owes me a very special bottle of rum. Rum. He tends the bar at Steam Weedle Port in Tanneris, Kalimdor, and he promised me promised me that the rum there is stronger than anything we could find in Booty Bay. He's so confident that he says if I try that rum and don't agree with him, then he'll double the money he owes me. Ooh. Well, I think he's not as confident as he was when he when we when last we spoke, and now he's afraid to give me that rum. But I don't back down from wagers. So why don't you talk to him for me? Speak with Stoli and Steam Weedle Port. So okay, run. so we have to go to uh, the, the um, Shimmering Flats. 
All right. Um, hold on, let me sell some stuff real quick. Sell this rod. Ooh, sells for gold. Sell this guy. Uh, I want to keep these clam meats because these are probably good for cooking. So I'm gonna keep these. I think that's all we have to sell for now. These pearls might go for something on the AH. Oh, okay. Here we go. New quest. Oh, how many quest slots do we have? Like, we have enough. Hi. How are you? Excuse me. Whiskey Slim's lost grog. We was splicing the main brace something fierce off of the overlooked cliffs. Old hinterlands just in the distance. Thought the seas was going to swallow us whole. Old Slim knows all about liquid courage. Captain had a, cra a crate of Pupple Verbos port? We, com we commandeered from a privateer en route to Stormwind. So when that storm off... Wait, what? So when that storm off of Hinterlands hit, I busted into the grog. Big wave hit and tossed them bottles overboard. Cap'n is going to give me a taste. Oh, the cat if ye don't help me get him back, though. Man, what the fuck is this guy saying? He's drunk, bro. What the fuck is he talking about? Whiskey Slim and Booty Bay wants you to bring him the bottles of Pupply Verbos port he lost. And he'll, kill, he'll give us some rum. All right, day. sure. We'll get you back your your rum that you lost, you freaking drunkard. All right, let's go accept more of these quests. Oh, we got a couple of them. Krasik. Tranrek. My cousin Tranrek is in a tight spot. He promised me a load of scarab shells weeks ago, and he hasn't delivered. He's my cousin. So I'd hate to have to send someone to Gadgetsan to break something on him. Can you speak to Tanrek for me? Let him know he needs to get that delivery together before I do something rash. Gadgetsan is in Northern Tanaris in Kalimdor. Okay, so we gotta go to Gadgetsan. Up to snuff. Ah, the sea life. I ain't gonna say it's the good life, but it's my life. When I get into port, I like to find me a good bottle of grog and some high quality snuff. Nasty habits, but what's a pirate without his vices, right? I guess. So you can imagine how heartbroken I was to find out the herbalist here in town has gone and sold out of the stuff. Says his shipment got hijacked by those damned blood cell raiders. I bet a fearless shaman like you could convince them to share the goods, eh? Deeg and Booty Bay wants you to bring him 15 shares of snuff. Be good. Okay. So we gotta get some snuff from the Booty Bay guys. All right, here's Fleet Master Seahorn. Well met. The Bloodsail Buccaneers. Bloodsail Buccaneers attacking Booty Bay. They might as well throw themselves off the overlooked cliffs. Nonetheless, by bringing me this information, you have done my fleet of swashbucklers a great service. The Blackwater Raiders thanks you. Kras speaks highly of your dedication to the Blackwater Raiders. I'm going to trust you with a mission of extreme importance to the fleet. Infiltrate the so-called Southern Command Post the Bloodsail Buccaneers have established on the Wild Shore, raid the encampment, bring me their charts along with their written orders, we shall see exactly what those scum are up to. Fleet Master Seahorn and Booty Bay wants you to kill 10 Bloodsail uh, Swashbucklers, and bring back the Bloodsail charts and the Bloodsail orders. Be sure, careful. I can do that for you. Alright, let's do that. We got a bunch more quests that we need to read. Um, oh, okay, we can get this quest now. Sick, so very, so, so sick. Have contracted Stranglethorn Fever, deadly virus. Only cure is, is to eat the heart of Ma, uh, Mock the Savage, elusive white beast. Witch Doctor Umbagwa, only one who can summon. Seek Umbagwa in Hidden Cave on Southern Cape. Hurry, dying, dying. Okay, so we gotta seek out which Dr. Umbagwa and have him summon Mok the Savage. Bring the heart of Mok to Fizz, Finn, Fizz rank it. And we get a cape! Uh, the stats aren't that great for me, but sure, we'll take the quest. He's dying, guys. We gotta help him. Alright, we got one more quest. Sorry if you guys don't like me reading these. If you guys do like me reading these, then... Uh, I guess that's good. But yeah, I like. I'm. Just, I'm gonna try starting. I'm gonna start uh, reading the quests out once I do them, because they have some pretty like interesting and like funny, you know, dialogue. Greetings. Keep an eye out. Avast. Who goes there? Arg. I am but useless without me special enchanted eye. Bad enough to have lost me eyes in battle in the first place. 
but by some stroke of luck, we docked in Menethil, and the traveling wizard enchanted a special glass eye that let me see again. Last night, I ended up getting jumped by some bloodstone buccaneers on me way out. Took me eye, they did. Seems those blokes have found their way to Booty Bay. Helping old Sea Dog out by getting me eye back. Dizzy One Eye in Booty Bay wants you to retrieve his eye from the Blood Cell Buccaneers, and we will receive a cape. So another cape. Oh, this cape is a little bit better in stats. Um, we don't gain agility, but we gain a stam. We gain two stamina and some armor, which is good. For the Alliance. All right. We got all the quests now. We got some more quests. We're definitely gonna be vibe now here in uh, Stranglethorn. Uh, where was that quest that I needed to turn in? I think it was like maybe over here. Akiris by the bundle. Yeah, who the heck? Oh, I gotta go to the um the dock or the bank. He's over here. Privateer bloods. All right. Greetings. If you got no business with me, then move along, hello B. Oh, I got business with you, motherfucker. You better take this damn fucking seaweed. Well done, hello B. Ten stalks of a curious reed wasn't too much a challenge after all, huh? No offense to the Naga, but hey, everybody's gotta make a living. Alright, we get 60 silver and we get a sash. This sash is pretty poo-poo, so I'm just gonna sell it uh, to the vendor. Alright, so we completed all- oh, we need to go to Gromgall. So we completed most of our quests and we're, uh, like halfway to 41, which is good. So I feel like by the time we turn in the Gromgall quest, um... We will definitely get a little bit more than halfway. Let me just vendor this guy. And, uh, should I just vendor this? I might sell it in the auction house. I'm gonna just try. Why not? It might sell. Alright, let's go to, um, Gromgall. And actually, actually, I think we might have enough to finish one of the, uh, Nesting Way Green Hills quest. So let me check again. So we need one, four, six, and eight. One, four, six, and do I have eight? I'm just gonna check anyways. Do I need eight? I might need eight. It might be ten. I don't know. I'm gonna check anyways. Let's go to Gromgall first, and then we can go to Nesting Way because they're kind of close. So I'll see you guys at Gromgall. Alright guys, let's go ahead and turn in McTharden Enchantment. Let's see what McTharden's got to say. I am almost ready to complete the enchantment. Have you performed my bidding? I have, sir. With this holy spring water, the ceremonial choker is ready for enchantment. Wear this with pride, hello B. In the name of the war chief and in defense of the mighty horde. Alright, and that's the last um, quest for the quest chain. Alright, cool beans. Speak, friend. Um, sorry I gotta turn your offer down, but this necklace kind of sucks for me, so... I'm gonna sell this. I'm not gonna wear it. No offense to you. All right, let me stop by Hemingway just to see if we can potentially complete a, a Green Hills quest. Oh man, guys, we're missing one page of each. For chapter one and two, we're missing one page of each, and then for chapter three, we're also missing one page. All right, so we couldn't. Um, Off with you. We can't complete it, but um, I think I'm gonna end the video here, guys. We've been going on for quite some time. Here, let me uh, get in position real quick. Alright, let's uh... This looks good. Alright, yeah, but that was uh... That was it, guys. We did some questing. Um, we started off with the trolls. Then we ended up at the Nagas. Um, we got to wear mail in this video. We hit 40. A bunch of uh... Important things happening. Good, A lot of good things. Um, and also, we picked up a bunch of quests. So... Uh, in the next video, we're probably going to be in Stranglethorn doing more quests. Um, which I don't mind. I, I love uh, Stranglethorn. It's one of my favorite zones. Um, but yeah, I think that's going to be it, guys. This one's going to be a little bit of a longer video. Um, and like I said earlier in the video, let me know. Do you guys like longer? Do you like them shorter? Are they just the right amount of time? Uh, let me know in the comments below. And make sure you guys like and sub. I'll see you guys tomorrow for another video. Um, I appreciate all the all the views and the likes and the whatever. Um, it means a lot to me. Thanks, guys. I'll see you guys. Peace.